are here at the show. We're gonna go pay a visit to our little friends over here. We need to get a pickup next time. Yeah, we don't fit in. <laughs> our little Nissan's not really much of a... There's trucks everywhere. Yeah, if you need a pickup, just come here. I'm sure you can pick one out. <laughs> There's a lot of pickups here. Too many pickups, actually. All right, let's go get in. I think we found the fan for the grain cleaner. Yeah. And what is this, like a... It just takes a 40 horsepower motor. 40 horsepower, that's um, more than pretty much all the fans on our grain bin so far at a grain bin setup. <laughs> that's wild. Walking around a little bit before people get in the gates, since I'm a exhibitor. That's kind of weird to think that. I got in a little earlier, which is nice. But looking at some of the equipment, and I had to say, I just, I gotta tell you guys, I love things that move dirt. I really do. This thing is, oh, that looks like the Batmobile. Thing's awesome. I, I really would love to have one of these. I'd move a little bit of dirt. Why? I don't know, but, oh, that's so sweet. I want that. I really want that. Actually, there's, there's a lot of things I want, but do I need it? Absolutely. This farm show is a big farm show. You could spend hours, hours out here just looking at stuff, talking to people, and everybody's very friendly, except for this guy. He's kind of a jerk. Look at, see, he just, shame. Shame you. Oh, can you see by the dawn's early light? Gotta love agriculture, patriotism. Don't lose it. God, this is the only reason why I came look to California. Look at these muscles. You've been working out, huh? The hotel, man. Holy yeah, they, had a, they had a good gym. Golly, I had kids and I quit. You did? No, you did. I did too. I've been no I'm way. wasting away. Yeah, I saw the pictures. It's pretty bad. Dude, it's, it's just all <laughs> white and hairy. See, but after the fourth kid, you just realize, you know what? The only reason you can don't look good is because you're just not doing it. So you start. I know. I'm gonna start. Go you got, you gotta get the look look yeah, it's looking real good. Come on, everybody. <laughs> Trevor here, Trevor Bales from Bales Hay. Yes, sir. The legendary. No. Been known to strip down once or twice for cameras, but where is patriotic swim trunks, right? Yes. Well, I wore Daisy Dukes uh, the other day. That's right, Daisy yeah. Dukes, that's what it was. Yeah. <laughs> Good to see you guys. You guys are here to drive the autonomous tractor? I wanted to lay down and see if it was smart enough to not run me over. <laughs> I have good reflexes, I'll so I, I would move like instantly, you know? We almost forgot. We got a meet and greet in like 20 minutes, so we got to get rolling. Uh, Zach, Trevor, and Randy. Good to see those guys. So we'll touch up with them soon, but yeah, don't want to miss the fans. That's uh, that's what we're here for is those guys. Not Randy, Zach, and Trevor. They're just icing on the cake. They're not the cake. You fans are the cake. We I'm like the crust. cake. He's the on crust. Cake. Which one is not? I know. Well, this one. Nobody this one is not. Yeah. I didn't think it'd be possible. Right. Somehow we got these guys front and center. They took our place today. <laughs> well, we got, we got the hats now. So we'll be signing hats tomorrow from 10 to 12.30. So if you guys are in the area, come by. Randy is special at signing. Yes. Yeah. yeah. He just, it takes three hats to get his name across it, though. He likes to put letters on each hat, so. <laughs> like the fill, fill the shapes. <laughs> the shape. well, we, we put dots first for him to connect, and then he goes, <laughs> where's Trevor? I keep asking, where's Trevor? We keep He's, losing We him. still gave him a connect the dots and half the <laughs> I just feel like I have to do this. Yeah, it doesn't have any air in it. It's a pretty sweet tire, though, to be honest. You know, it's funny things you find. Farm shows make a lot of sense. Some things don't make a lot of sense. Like that thing. I don't get why they bring a rock to the show. A big one like that, too. Hey guys. Him, him, but not him. him not him? But not that guy. Suitcase. Okay, but just tell him to keep his clothes on this time. Is it because I'm There's no <laughs> It has happened sporadically. So we're in the middle right now of our, our road trip. Zach and Randy do America with Trevor. With Trevor. You gotta put it in parentheses. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Trevor, can you wave the camera, please? Yeah. yeah can you, there, uh, hi, hi, camera. No, look, look at the camera. <laughs> Trevor, no, the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, I'm Nick from Welcome Farms. Nick Welcome Welcome Farms, also known as Hollywood. And I'm Blake Arms, also known as Blake Scott Arms. Scott Welker. <laughs> <laughs> it's different here. Um, there's trees, lots of them. And this is different than Shelby, Montana? Yeah. And all these trees look the same. Like they're all the same. Like you look out a road, and you're like, you know, trees should be different. They're all the same. 
Everyone, then, same and, height. It's like someone trims them. And they're straight in the grass, too. Yeah. Did someone plant those? Did you notice some of the grass is even green? Is that so called grafting? Yes. 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 So you Every know all about single... it? single... Well, I mean, we've done this for the last 150 years. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> it's your show, Nick. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> so Trevor broke the, the nodder display twice today. So now we've got a bunch of nodder oh, hay guys through, fixing the nodder yeah, that Trevor broke. Trevor's very naughty. Naughty. Get out of here. <laughs> I didn't know how to word it. Dude. It worked out. <laughs> it worked out. Well, I missed it. What I, you're naughty. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're at the Case IH booth, and we've got a new unit on the lot here. This is Jeremy. Nice Hello. to meet you, Jeremy. See you. And Jeremy's going to talk about the new Optimum. So, yeah. so we had this Optimum for a while, but this year we got some new upgrades. It now comes with our AFS cab with our Pro 1200 display in it. So you can see that guy's really kind of deluxe. Push button start. Got a remote for my door locks. And <laughs> really? Everything. Yeah, it's kind of the it's kind of the Cadillac setup for the tractors. So we build two sizes of this Optum. We build a 300 horsepower and a 270 horsepower, both with a CVX transmission. So a couple options we can put on a good front hitch PTO. So it's great for the guys wanting to do like triple mowers or in the fact that it's a, a CVX with the 50 kph training so I can really get up to 30 to 2 mile an hour road speeds. So great for the guys with big slurry tankers. They love this tractor for doing a lot of roading. Just a comfortable, comfortable cab. This is kind of loaded up. It's got all the extra light packaging on it. The front hitch on the front of it as well. So big trail board tires. I was going to say, yeah, the, the, the tires yeah. and the wheelbase of the tractor is pretty amazing. Pretty impressive. They're stout tractors. They just don't give up. They just they just keep giving you the power and just keep working and just keep going for you. So tough, tough tractors. Good. Well, cool. Thank you, Jeremy. I'm going to climb around and take a look at it. Excellent. Appreciate it, sir. Thank you. So, these things, yeah, not your typical tractor you'd see out in our area. This is a low profile, and the reason for these is to catch the branches when you're going through the orchards, so they ride up the side of this and don't smack the windows. And I was kind of looking in here, and I'm like, is this thing we got a roll cage? Well, technically, the old roll cage would have been back here, but these uh, cool cabs are designed to take the roll of the tractor in case you ever to tip one over. So these are an aftermarket. These tractors are sent to a place where they put these cabs on here and these roll kits and get them set up for this type of industry. Really cool. <laughs> Look at this cute thing. So, that would be a vineyard tractor. And that's for like your grapes, real Whoa! narrow row stuff. That guy's awesome. Yeah, boy. <laughs> um, anyways, with that said, this, this roll cage in the front, you don't see that very often, but neat little tractor, honestly. I would still drive it. And then you got the pizza cutters. This is the Case IH Farmall 140. A, I almost said B. Look at those things. Some like, like uh, pivot, pivot wheels. Isn't that awesome? Not often you see hydrostatically driven steel tracks. That's pretty wild. Look at that operator. Yeah, look at that. These things are so cool. So cool. I would love, love to run one of these trimmers. Wow. Look at that madness. Oh, it just looks, it looks mean. Beware spiders. Giant spiders from outer space. 
Don't even think about it. We're ready for you. Don't even think about it. Here's some old iron. Oh, look at that. That is beautiful. Old Alice Chalmers, HD7. Wow, 1948. Isn't that nice? And here we got an old farm on Cormac. That's a nice track too. <laughs> Look at the size of this belt running that blower. I mean, it obviously works. This is a cotton picker, it looks like. So it'd probably take a lot of power to pull that cotton up there. But a little farm all back there. They basically just took, if you look closely, they just took a tractor. That's the front of the tractor. It's just a whole tractor. And they just basically drive in reverse. Look. That's just that's just a regular farm all tractor, pretty much. Like a row crop version with this unit built on the back of it. But that's not the front. That is neat. And what's a farm show without a serious aircraft? Because every farmer needs one of those. Parachutes included. Seriously. Check it out. They do have parachutes. That thing looks mean. I want like five. All right, combine harvesters are pretty complex. Look at this thing. Isn't that amazing? It's a grape harvester or something? I mean, it's just it's so cool. So cool, the engineering to this. Wow. That's amazing. That is amazing. The show is just about over, and these guys, they're getting stuff around to start driving stuff out of here. It's pretty fast. When they're like ready to go, they all get out of here quickly. It's kind of a rush. The whole, whole entire grounds here, everybody's like, okay, let's be the first to get out of here. Otherwise, we're gonna be backed up and it'll be a long time until we get out of here. So it's kind of fun to watch. They just run around like ants, get their machines and bleh, they're out.